guys and today i'd like to do um a haul video on two different trips that i went on this first let's start off with this one recently i went to woodfield mall not near chicago since it's nearby we decided to drive down there to brick mania store and so i got the brick arms m2hb i might do a review on this i'll have to see comment down below so and then the big thing was the World War One Trench Warfare French Cannon with the two exclusive new minifigures that recently Brick Media came out with. And they have the rifles. So I was pretty pumped to get this. So yeah, I'll have to do I'm gonna do a review on this. And I have mentioned in past videos um that I would be and also I, I was thinking about if you should you guys should go if you haven't seen it go check out that video of this mock. I was thinking about if I extend and keep adding on to this mock, I might add it just because I actually I didn't I didn't have it built yet, so I used that um cannon or artillery cannon. But historically, I mean you can't tell a difference, but it's not historically accurate. So I want to try to change it out or add this to it because that'd be more accurate. Historically, because this was actually used during the trench warfare. So yeah, there's those two things. I'll, have to do, I'll do a review on them. And then recently, a big trip I did was Brick Universe Madison 2018, which I was really excited for. I went to the convention, and I was planning to get more. But honestly, I wasn't prepared, and I was looking more than buying. So for sure, next time I go, I'll get a ton more stuff. So we got this little postcard that came with it. It shows our social medias, different stores. There's that. Pause the video if you want to look at that. And then we got the items which we got. We I was thinking about building some more Russian minifigures for the SU-85 because I was thinking of doing a Russian mock or including the Germans and Russian forces. So I got a few different ones. I think this was the Battle of Stangalord. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Um, I I know the history of the battle. I just don't know how to pronounce the name really correctly or pronunciation. So there's a gray helmet of that, and then the World War Two mid war Germ um, Russian infantry. I got a t two tan one and a lime green one right here. And actually. And actually, I did get a brown one of this, too. And actually, to have an idea of what I was thinking about building, you can see those two right there that I was thinking about building or something close to that. And we did. We got three German World War Two, I think, or World War One, either one, German helmet, helmets. The only reason you see one here is because I was using the other for a mox at the moment. Let me show you. Because I was using... I did actually buy the torso, head, and helmet at Brick Universe, and I bought two full sets of those. I didn't bring the pants or the these, but these were something else I bought at Brick Universe because it's way cheaper than buying individual figures for a lot more money. So, And I do have some gray, as you see here, legs, so I can just use those. Cause, and then I bought a Nord torso, torso, which I think this was a German here soldier, just normal German infantry. So I got the torso, the head, and the helmet too. So I got three helmets, two torsos, and two heads. So I just placed that back in the mock. And if you haven't seen the video on that mock, go check it out. Again, so we got that. Three helmets. And I think I bought this. Yeah, I think I bought this legs. Or I just threw it in with the mix, but... There's that. So I did enjoy it and I hope to buy more next time. So that's about it for this video. I there's I will be posting another video soon, so stay tuned for that. And that's about it. I'll wrap it up. Com like, comment, subscribe, comment down below what you want to see next. And if you enjoyed this video and want to see more. And I will try to respond to your comments more. I mean, I, I've only missed, like, one comment in one of my other videos I haven't responded to yet. But, yeah, I'll try to respond to all your comments. Bye!